stay in the zone during your next esports tournament or give yourself a pick me up during late night gaming sessions and punishing live streams with quantum energy. Created for gamers by gamers, the sugar free energy drink offers a balanced blend to give you a noticeable boost of energy without the nasty crash. Quantum energy drink is easy to carry around during gaming conventions or while you're on the road. There's no need to lug around heavy cans. This compact and lightweight tub fits easily into a backpack. Use the link in the description and when you check out the code GD for 10% off all orders. Hello YouTube, welcome back to the People's Poor Man Road to Glory. Today's episode is just rewards. We've got rival rewards. We're going to have an 85 times 10 pack and we're also going to have our foot chance rewards. So this week we finished uh, rank 1 obviously um, in Div 1. So we're going to have fantastic rewards, we're going to have 2 Megas and we're going to be having 225k packs on top of our um, Gold 1 rewards as well. So we've got a lot of packs open in this episode and hopefully we can pack some great players. Because I need to complete my this by the start of Weekend League and I can only play Weekend League on Friday and Saturday, that won't be happening. I need to play Weekend League on Friday. And I, I don't have no, any, I basically have no players uh, to comp Now we've got our next mega pack. Our first one didn't get us anything and this one won't get us anything either. Can't do anything from these megas. Alright uh, boys, our two 125k packs, at least a one walkout from one of these. Have to, have to get at least one walkout. No walkout in the first one. That's just what we're getting. Are you serious? Ah, uh, 85, 83, 82. Alright boys, our next one, surely we get something. Surely we get a walkout. We got all these cards in, in, available. Uh, I can't believe what I've witnessed. We got one of these stupid cards again, man. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's ridiculous, man. That, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. That is a legit joke. That's a joke, EA. You, you, you scum of a company, you pulse your mutts, man. Right, boys, as you can see on the screen, we have completed the 85 times 10 upgrade SBC. And we did it literally for 16k. We had photo in our club. So, we should be making back on this SBC. Let's get into the packs. 85 times 10. 85 plus times 10. Let's do this. Walkout record breaker. It's gonna be Fabregas. Yep. For the potentially what? How many times have I packed this? Fifth cut time. Ooh! All right. Hey, you know what? I take it back. That's a pretty good pack, if you ask me. Hey, that's a very good pack if you ask me. Boom. Look at that. Hazard, 93 rated. This card's almost too good to give him, man. What a card this is. Then we've got Modric. We've got Saka. Kimpembe. Bale. Nine Golden. This card was a beast for us. Remember when we were using this card at the beginning of the FIFA? Um, 90 to Stadium. Milinkovic Skrinja. That is a top, top quality pack. I'm not going to lie. We might be able to use this guy as well for um, our Dama Traore objectives. I presume that we need EPL players. We also got Inform Bale. So, yeah. Oi, that is a good pack, boys. Our 85 times 10. I take it. I take it, definitely. That should be able to complete our... Alright, boys. Well, our rival rewards were shocking. Let's hope our foot change rewards can can be better than that. Um, so yeah, we finished gold one, which is big, massive. We get 50k and two tradable 100k packs, plus two picks, surely, boys. All right, our first two picks. Let's go. Minimum one overall, one overall from the main leagues. First one, all black. All right, 96 rated. He shall be fodder. Next pick. Uh, 
apparently we cannot get Mbappe, Ronaldo, Messi or Neymar. Let's go, 100k packs. This is the worst rewards ever. Ever. Walk out. Oh. Per whatever this is. What is this? Suarez? 90 rate to Suarez tradable. Probably worth beans. Oh. It's something. Oi. Oi, that's better. Alright. Last one. First one was good. First one was good. That's good. That's all we want. Alright, we hit another one. This just looks like it's gonna be a gold. A, a Christian. Oh, that's gonna be the. Hmm. Which probably goes for a lot of money now. He probably goes for heaps. Alright, here we go. Our second 85 plus 10. Uh, this is really good. Really good. My first pack was phenomenal. So let's hope this is just as good. It's another record breaker, and we're gonna get Sus Fabregas, who we put into this SBC. However, last time he showed up first, and then we got 93 Hazard. So this time, eh, 87, 86, 91 is good. 88, 86, 91 is good as well. It's not too bad. Definitely worth it. That's for sure. So yeah, hey, we got 90, 291s, which is good. 88, just 86, 88 is all here. So yeah, not too bad. We should be able to complete the bundle. All right, boys, let's talk about our team that we're going to go into the weekend league with. As you can see, it has changed drastically. Absolutely drastically to the team that we played with last weekend. So where did it change? As you can see, first of all, we got Atal as our striker. The 94, we use him as our striker in-game. He's ridiculous. If not the best card I've used this year. Look at these stats, boys. 99 acceleration, 99 sprint speed, 99 finishing. He's got the dribbling. And not only that, he's got the defending stats. And we actually put him on aggressive interceptions. So he gets those little interceptions that no other striker will be getting. And that's down to his 92 defending. So it's ridiculous. This card is ridiculous. Um, the Panzer comes in for Florenzi. Now, I still feel like Florenzi is the better card, the five star, five star. Definitely, Florenzi was absolutely insane for us. Look at that, over a hundred goal contributions in a hundred uh, in two hundred games from the box to box position. So a phenomenal um, output from Florenzi. However, the Panzer is unreal as well and the panzer allows the atal to be on 10k which is big and i prefer it that way and there's nothing wrong with the panzer he comes in and yeah he is our, our new box to box phenomenal card boys there's nothing else to say this card is end game this card is insane and the best thing is we now have Florenzi on the bench he can come in for the panzer he can come in left back Literally cam any position. Florenzi is so versatile. And then, as you can see, boys, we have this card right here. I reckon I'll be one of the first people in the world to unlock this 95 Adama Traore. Five-star skills, four-star week for high-low. He's going to be playing instead of Alessandrini this week. And I want to see who's better. However, he should have the juice with the 99 strength, the 85 aggression, all that plus 10 baby oil on him. He should be phenomenal. I'm hoping that this card is phenomenal. And I'm hoping now we should have the attack to be able to live up to the tags of Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar and Bappe that we have not been given. Our luck has just... We can't get them. For some reason, in our picks, we just cannot get... A Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar, or Mbappe team this season or Summer Stars. However, I think finally we're going into a weekend league with our attack, which is just as good. We've got Atal, we've got Maradona, we've got Adama Traore, incredible. Also, boys, Varane. Varane makes a reappearance. We bought this card. He is just so good i don't know where to start with this card this card is one of the best center back. this card is if not just as good as his 98 ramos i can only imagine this team of the season i don't know 
Howe is just so coded well into this game, but he is just insane, like absolutely insane. Um, and yeah, he partners our uh, centre backs. How we set up in game, this is basically what I play the most in. Balance, these are my width and depth, fast build up, put it on wide because we play the narrow 5 2 1 2. Our back line is Jordi Alba, Sergio Ramos, Varane, Zambrota, Carvajal. Our midfield is Mateus, Diong, Maradona as our number 10, and Atal and Adama Traore up front. Then what we do is Atal stay forward, getting behind, Adama Traore stay forward, getting behind. Um, and now because I've swapped them around, so Adama will be on normal. Uh, Atal will be on aggressive interceptions and actually conservative. So yeah, so Adama on conservative, Atal on aggressive interceptions because of his defensive stats. Maradona stay forward, free roam. Mateus, I have him on completely balanced. De Jong, I have him stay back. And then Jordi Alba, I have him balanced over that because I want him to attack. I don't want to play in a five back. I want to essentially play in a three at the back. And then Carvajal on balance overlap. And then our keeper come for cross the sweeper keeper. So that's how the team sets out, boys. Last week, we finished goal one. I don't know if I'll have the time now with uni to play till goal one. But we'll see how we go. This is our bench as well. Like, yeah, we've got a phenomenal team. Except we don't have one of those big boys yet. Which hopefully one day we might eventually get. However, with... Um, a tile with a Dharma Chora, I think we should be all good. The only position now is upgrading Jordi Alba to his Summer Stars, and then our team is set. That That's literally it, the end game team, and then we'll probably end the series on that, boy. So, big, big video, a lot of packs, a lot of rewards, very, very um, disappointing in terms of our packs. However, we did all right with our full champs, 100k packs. Our picks were horrible again, but what can you do? Anyway, boys. This is another video to put poor man roads to glory. This is how our team is looking at July. Phenomenal. We cannot complain. Anyway, boys, as always, remember, relax, have a euros, and I'll be back in the next video.